Hello and welcome to a really quick Adobe Illustrator CS3 lesson on how to make the shape of a face. Uh, we're just going to use the ellipse tool and the white arrow tool plus the add anchor tool. So let's get started right away. We'll grab the ellipse tool over here on the left and we're just going to make drag and make an ellipse. And we're going to grab the white arrow tool and you'll notice right now that there are four points on the outside. This is not a point, it's just the center. Uh, so we'll grab these two with the white arrow tool. So we start on the outside, drag to the other side, and you'll notice that these are now blue and these are white. That means the blue ones are selected. Then I'll just grab my uh, up arrow key and hold it till I'm fairly happy with the shape of the head. Then I'm going to grab the Add Anchor tool, which is underneath the pen tool. So you click and hold down. Anytime you see these little triangles on any of these tools, you, you have more than one choice. So I'm going to click and hold, grab the Add Anchor tool, and actually I'll change this quick with the black arrow tool and move it over just a bit to the right so that you'll notice that this is right in the center because I'm going to use these minor grid lines to tell me how far I am apart. So I'm going to click on the add anchor tool now and I'm going to count one, two, three and then I'm going to click right on the line. And I'm going to do it once because this happens all the time where you aren't right on the line and this sign comes up. So you say OK and you must click right on the line. One, two, three minor grid lines. Then I'll grab my white arrow tool and I'll select, a click and drag over the middle of the three bottoms and I'll use my up arrow key just to move up, just to give it a more of a flat chin. And if you want to give it that, you know, extra, I'm not going to, but you may. So that's your choice on how much you want to do. And there you have it. That's how to create the shape of a head. If you're not happy with the aspect, just go to the black arrow tool and if you want to make it thinner you can if you want to make it shorter you may right so you can head it this way any way you want so there you have a face thanks